Alright guys, um good afternoon, morning, good evening, wherever you're connecting from. So I don't know about you, um, but I've been on my ALX stats for a while now. I did everything, everything. Let me quickly open up my let me quickly open up my sandbox. I did everything. And then, despite everything I've been doing, I realized that ever since I did this, my tax were not checking. As you can see, it was all on 0%, and it literally had to bring me down, it literally had to bring me down to my 0%, 0%, 0%, zero percent yeah i had to literally come down to the third deadline and i just discovered what really happened to my code and it's simply because you know when you are so overwhelmed with a tax that you forgot to look into details and that might be exactly what is going on what may happen to one of you i just don't know but just in case i sorted and sorted for help it was pretty not easy to find one. Thank God for a close friend that I had that she just mentioned something and then I recalled. Yeah, her name was Vivian. Her name is Vivian. So um it's actually on this tax one. They stated it clearly that after installing our web servers, after installing my SQL my SQL on our web servers one and two, what I like doing, I like running this twice. So that I can use one for my uh, one two use one for my server one use the next for my server two. That's how I like doing mine. SLC should run two. So yeah, I have my I have my server one and two, my web O one and web O two. You realize that I literally did all of these tasks. I let me show you an example. Let's run one of these here. I tried and tried. My checker refused. Uh, okay, I think I didn't use my password. The password I chose was the password that was here. Yeah, this was my password. Let's try that again. Yeah, and you can see that even if we do the same for this. Even if you do the same for this, even if you do the same for this, like this is perfect, right? My way one and two. How come? How come I have a zero check? And that's actually what we're going to be treating here and now. And like I was saying, it was on this tax one. I did a very very big mistake. They told us that for us to give them access to our for for us to give them access to our servers for them to be able to check our tax we should make sure that we do this tax three of our ssh project so if you didn't take that serious like me you will be in a big big mess and it was that simple remember in this tax three what we did here was simply to um what we did here was simply to um open up this and add like if you recall uh let me see if i open another another sandbox so that you you, react, you understand what i'm trying to say let me just use my web 10. so if you remember we did something like this where we assess our roots dot ssh then we created a file called authorized keys and on our authorized keys 
uh, what's wrong with my network on our authorized keys that was where we added this you know this exactly all right so if i hit enter you see if i do set number then you see this is that file clgwkn CLGWK and this this is very very important this is literally what is going to grant its access to check our let me not save this just in case so that's literally we should be running this same thing here if you forgot like myself then you'll be having that same battle if you forgot like myself because I myself I literally forgot I literally forgot to so make sure you know you can do this even though you want to do this it still means the same thing you can still do this uh, yeah, authorized keys yeah that is it and you can see I just added this I just added this i just added i added it on both servers to make sure make sure that you do just in case you didn't that is the reason why your file your tax is not checking if you forgot to add it so just in case you forgot like me to add it please and um, please do so now this is my web too as you can see they've been added now on both my tags and the moment you do that you have access to your sql and now your tax will be checked so i just i just try that out and then see you can see zero text let's run my checker again so i just tried that out and then i discovered that wow this was I was so excited and I decided to just share it because I know you see that that's done. After that, we ask for correction because I know literally I went, I went through hell. Like I was so, I was really, really angered, almost, almost went crazy. And this really refused to check, refused to check. I checked and checked, I tested all the tags, everything was just perfect. And I was like, what's going on? So this is that simple thing. So just in case, just in case you didn't do this in yours, um, do well to do it. Then we run your checkers and it will be all done. So um, thank you so much. I hope I've been able to help one way or the other. If I have, please leave a like, a comment and subscribe to our channel all we post i've never posted about alx i hope and i plead that they don't tag me for plagiarism we literally post various other contents about tech if you go through the playlist you see there is a playlist on use ui ux where you can literally learn ui ux from start to finish and um soon as we'll be uploading lots of other cool contents like front end back end etc so thank you so much and um do well to subscribe i don't know why i i think it's because of my internet that my checker is taking a little while to run but nonetheless it's going to all check you can see it's checked and um, i'll just do that for all of my remaining tasks so thank you don't forget to subscribe to the channel i'm out